so this is Audrey and she is a type of a pitcher plant. Um, we named her that because I think the plant in the Little Shop of Horrors is named Audrey or something. One of those movies. I haven't seen it. But anyways, um, it is a carnivorous plant and if you haven't seen these already, there's these pitchers on it. Um, ours just started growing these. When we bought it, it didn't have any. Um, because it wasn't very healthy, so it needed some fertilizer and things, and now it gets these little things, and then this is going to be a pitcher soon. And there's one starting right there, and there's a full-sized one. And so ever since our plant, um, even before it started getting the pitchers on it, um, we haven't had fruit flies, so it's pretty good. Um, obviously this one's doing really really good. I just sprayed it down. Um, there's another picture in there. They're pretty neat. Um, so what happens is um, these plants, they give off a smell and they attract the fruit flies into the pitchers. Um, and even before they have the pitchers, it seemed like the fruit flies were kind of hanging around it and they weren't um, in our fruit and stuff anymore. So it's been it's a really good thing to have in our kitchen. Um, and obviously the plant really likes it here. It is pretty happy and, or she, she's pretty happy, excuse me. <laughs> and we're pretty happy to have a pitcher plant because we don't have to put out all these funny fruit fly traps anymore for it. We used to keep little like rotten jars of like, you know, fermented fruit juice or they really like vinegar, apple cider vinegar and those sorts of things. And we don't have to do that anymore because this thing, it, if you can see it in the light, there's actually, hmm, let's see, through there in that picture, there's some water in it, and that's what the fruit flies go into. They get stuck in that water right there, and then the plant digests them and uses them for food. Pretty neat, <laughs> and kind of fun too.